Now, um, young man, I noticed that you said God was good, and um, that's understood, but it doesn't do my God enough justice. Amen. Amen. You see, God is good. All the time. And all the time. God is good. No, he's phenomenal. You see, but he doesn't get enough credit for his crimes because the price he paid, it wasn't nominal. You see, he died for us to live. That's ironical. Sounds like a stand-up guy without the comical because he's been working on me from the core and I'm not talking about abdominal. Come on. He will work it out, but not that way. Amen. I say God is good. All the time. And all the time. God is good. No, my God is excellent, remarkable, riveting, astonishing. He's medicine to heart troubles, the remedy to tons of things. These testaments of articles I'm visioning are promising. Neglecting it is horrible. Sickening, I'm vomiting. Oh, Lord, come on, somebody. Come on, somebody. Um, congregation, bear with me because I had my lesson planned, but it seems um, the Holy Spirit wants me to talk to Pastor Phil. Uh, something is not right with his spirit, so I'm here to expose how Pastor Phil is. And, 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 and question if he's really doing the master's will amen you see um we are both prosperity preachers but when you speak about franklin's and raising for the church when i speak about franklin's it's because i'm praising like i'm kirk come on somebody y'all don't hear me y'all don't hear me look at your neighbor and say stay focused amen 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 you see let me talk to you um you see your concentration should be consecration instead of compensation from the congregation. Amen. I don't think you hear me. I said your concentration should be consecration instead of compensation from the congregation. Amen. In other words, he's spending tithes and offering on new church shoes and church hats for his church boo instead of broken church pews. Take heed. I'm just trying to alert you. Holding out on God can eventually hurt you. So if you and your so-called woman of virtue don't want to be called home before curfew, Stop these sinful acts. Chapter 5, verse 2. Come on, somebody. They don't hear me. They don't hear me. They don't hear me. Come on, somebody. Amen.